Africa if you need help, medical help, it is hard to get. If you don't have the money, you probably won't get help. It's just that simple. I really have a heart for people who are in poverty. I really want to make a difference. I really want my life to have meaning. It's that instinct in you. I just have something in that, okay, well of course, I have to do something. My name is Scott. I think we may be able to help you. If you will let me, we would like to take you to Monrovia. We have, we have a ship. And the doctors will look at you, for free. Screening day is a day full of joy and a, and a day full of sadness too because you see so many different people, some that you can help. But there's also the people that you see and you think, wow, we can't help them. It's hard to say to someone with so much hope of being helped, no, we can't help you and you will die from this. They get picked out one by one from the whole country and they come individually on their day of operation. Their family comes and they're all dressed in their best clothes because they really, and it really is, their last hope. When someone's bandage gets taken down for the first time and they really look in the mirror and you can experience their joy. You see them, and even in the recovery room, they'll reach up and they'll just they'll feel because they they want to confirm you know that this thing that has been with them for so long is, is really gone, and then they sort of relax and back into their kind of their haze, post anesthetic haze. But they they're awake enough that they want to make sure that that thing is gone. You look fine. You look all right. Thank you.